Hi, in this video I will show you how to use the website called The Noun Project. So I'm, I'm going to Google it, The Noun Project. But you can also type it, it's uh, thenounproject.com, so you get there quickly. Well, to be able to download pictograms from The Noun Project, you need to create an account. So I already did. So I, I will log into my account so I can download pictograms. Okay. All right, once you log in, you can start looking for pictograms. Um, in this case, you don't have filters to refine your search, so in, in this case, you need to use your better judgment. For example, if I'm looking for animals for a handout, so just click on the search bar. And see, I, I get a variety of designs. So uh, again, you should be consistent when choosing the, the pictograms. So if, if, I, if you're using black pictograms, then use the uh, same style. If you're using white pictograms, if you scroll down, sometimes you, fi you find collections. So collections follow the same style. So for example, we have animals and bird line icons. If I go there, all the pictograms will have the same design. So, uh, for example, let's imagine I, I want to download this elephant, so I click on the pictogram. See, if I, I can save it to favorites, so I, I don't lose track of the pictogram. Or if I just want to download it right away, I click on get this icon. See that there are pro and basic downloads. So I will use basic because I don't want to pay. Continue. And again, choose basic. And I have two formats PNG, SVG. SVG is, for example, for large um, sizes such as a billboard or a banner. See, I have a few. Uh, editing options, it can rotate, flip, change the color, color the line. If I'm satisfied with the way it looks, just I will just click on PNG and save the file. And then I will just need to insert it in any document, just like any other images. So I hope you all you also find. Uh, the noun project useful to design teaching materials.